Good morning. Thank you for joining us live here on India Today this morning. I'm Akshita Nandakopal and we'll be focusing on the Prime Minister's visit to America. The latest ground reports coming your way on exactly what the Prime Minister's schedule looks like for the day ahead. Geeta Mohan will be taking you through all the updates over the next one hour from Washington, D.C. Before I hand it over to Geeta, here's a quick check of all the headlines. Prime Minister Modi reaches U.S. for three-day diplomatic and business outreach. We'll hold talks with U.S. Vice President Kamala Harris to meet the CEOs of five top multinational companies today. Focus on China, Pakistan, counter-terrorism and Afghanistan. The situation when it comes to regional security, all these will come up when Prime Minister Narendra Modi engages the world. Watch India today for all the latest news and updates. Ahead of the big ticket quad summit tomorrow, Prime Minister Modi to meet his Australian and Japanese counterparts today. Prime Minister Modi thanks Indian community for the rousing welcome in Washington, D.C., commends the Indian diaspora for distinguishing itself across the world. Prime Minister Modi slams vaccine racism, asks countries to honour vaccine certificates after UK's quarantine dictates for Indian flyers, even after getting approved COVID shield jabs. Interstitial travel should be made easier through mutual recognition of vaccine certificates. Kalipuri, Vice Chairperson of India Today Group, wins for outstanding contribution to media at the prestigious AIMA Managing Media Awards 2021. Other winners included Adi Godrej, Sanjeev Goenka and Adar Ponawala. The award is very special to me, coming in the time of the endless cycles of lockdown and unlockdown of Corona, which has tested every dimension of my leadership. And because this award is for outstanding contribution in media, I would like to dedicate it to our latest and newest launch, GNT, a Hindi news channel called Good News Today.